I thought for sure it would just blow over. I've seen this happen to a number of my colleagues in Florida. It seems like it happens every time somebody challenges, uh, you know, the, 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 the whatever information might be um, uh, being put out by the governor. Or in this case, the Department of Education, which has sort of become a politicized uh, branch of uh, the DeSantis administration and kind of now the DeSantis campaign. You know, but, but this was propaganda and it was a waste of my time. And that's ultimately like what I was saying to them. This this waste my time and and it's done, uh, it, it, you know, in a clear vein of propaganda. This is objectionably propaganda. And I read the whole thing because I give them the benefit of the doubt because they work for the people of Florida. And I yeah. want to do right by my readers. And so sure. when this wastes my time, and it's just propaganda. I feel like I have the right to say so. And, yeah. uh, and and I feel like what Axios did to me has a chilling effect on the entire news media. It's a very sad thing. I was talking to my agent today about whether there was a book in this. And, um, you know, maybe there is. Uh, maybe it's time that somebody um, isn't afraid to stand up to DeSantis and write a true uh, biography of him. Um, so I might be the guy to do 